So look, y'all. What I'm getting right now is people are treating you different. You know what I'm saying? The reason why people are treating you different because you are changing. You are changing fast right now. Did you look at yourself in the mirror today? You don't look the same. Your face is changing. Your body is changing. The way you feel is changing. The way you view things is changing. The way you view yourself is changing. That's the most important thing. The way you view yourself is changing. And you feel that. It's like every time you look in the mirror, you're like, damn, I look different. Yeah, you look different. Let me tell you why you look different. Because you are a spiritual being that is having a human experience. Your spirit and your soul already know what I'm saying right now. And you went through a portal. And this portal is literally perspective. And when you go through a portal, your perspective change and the way you view yourself change and the way you view the world change because you have literally shifted reality. Now you are in another parallel universe. You are experiencing a parallel universe. This is a multi-dimension you are experiencing. This world you are experiencing right now is a multi-dimensional world. It's a parallel universe. Everything is look the same, but everything is different right now, right? When you look at the when you look at something, it's like it looks the same, but something seems different. Your eyes gotten brighter. Like when you see colors, like colors are brighter to you now. You barely can be around light. You don't like light at all. Like, the light that's in your house, you don't like light at all. You turn that shit off. You like, oh, this shit hurt my eyes. You're sensitive to light. You're sensitive to energy. You love being alone. Like, you don't, you don't really know why. Like, you be smiling a lot. Like, even when things are going, quote, unquote, left, quote, unquote, right, like, even when things is not going your way, it's like you still smiling. Like you just know something good is about to happen in your life. You just know God has a plan for you. You just know that. You have a very powerful imagination. What I'm getting right now is your imagination is so powerful, it be having you smiling. I'm saying the visions you see in your mind, it reminds you what you are destined to be in this world. People do not want you to recognize your spiritual gift. So whoever you are around right now, they do not want you to recognize your spiritual gift. They do not want you to use your spiritual gift because when you begin to use your spiritual gift, now you are raising people awareness. Right now, you are raising a lot of people awareness. A lot of people look at you. They don't know what they're looking at. They don't know if they're looking at an alien. They don't know if they're looking at an angel. They don't know. If they, they don't know what they're looking at because you doesn't you don't look human at all. People look into your eyes, they get afraid because what they're, what they're feeling is something that makes them uncomfortable. You make a lot of people feel uncomfortable because, because you are vibrating high. And when you vibrate high, that means you are a demon slayer. You slay demons. You slay your demons and you slay demons that attack you. You know what I'm saying? Like, you really slay demons. When you be sleeping, you slay the shit out of these demons. You know what I'm saying? You not having these quote-unquote bad dreams for no reason. You slaying the fuck out of demons. Your name ring a lot of bells in the spiritual world like you are immortal as fuck. Every time they quote-unquote killed you, you came back. And... When you are vibrating high, your energy screams, I am back, nigga. <laughs> Real. Your energy screams that. Like, 
God really loves you. You have the spirit of the almighty God. You are the most high child. And a lot of people, they don't understand you. They don't understand you because it was never meant for them to understand you. It was never meant for them to understand you. But look, though, you're going to meet people that's going to understand everything you say. Like, they may not agree with everything you say, but they're going to understand you. And y'all both going to help each other grow spiritually, mentally, physically, in all areas. I'm here. You are here to strengthen your spiritual gift. Whatever you are, whatever you are spiritually gifted at, you are here to strengthen that gift. You are here to bring awareness to the to the masses of people. So your gift is meant to bring awareness to the masses of people. You are here to cause a masses awaken in your reality. So whoever knows you or whoever once knew you, they're going to see you. And these the exact words they're going to say. You changed my life. Say, for example, you are 17 now. But if in the next five years, next six years, seven years, you finna be 25, 24, 26, 27. You doing your thing and you run into an old friend from middle school. And this old friend from middle school is like, hey, they say your name. They're like, is that you? Is that you? Is that you? You changed my life, man. You changed my life, man. Like, I'm hearing somebody saying, you changed my life. Like, literally. And you're going to change a lot. You're going to go through a lot of phases. You're going to change a lot. And the people that know you, they they not going to be able to, like, really comprehend, like, what is happening to you. Because they feel like you are just, you are, you are just, quote, unquote, evil for leaving them behind but they are projecting how they feel about themselves these program bots in the matrix they are evil they are evil spirits these evil spirits they did a lot to keep you from evolving these evil spirits didn't want you to evolve these evil spirits they wanted to kill you off they wanted to take you off this planet so you're going to see a lot of people for who they are. I'm saying the more you go down this rabbit hole, the more you go down the unknown, the more you keep walking what's what's down there. The more you go down the unknown, the more you're going to see people for who they are. You're going to run across a lot of quote unquote famous people, celebrities, uh, people that's well known. You can run across a lot of these people and you can be like, damn, these people not who they these people not who they say they are when it comes to this internet shit. Like, they not who they say they are. Yeah. These are program clones. These are, these are program bots for the Matrix. I'm saying you, you are literally here to expose the ones that are hiding. You are here to expose the ones that are pushing a agenda to keep these souls and spirits trapped. You are freeing the spirits and souls. In this lifetime, in this reality you are experiencing, in this parallel universe, in this multidimensional universe, you are here to free the spirits and souls. You are here to guide these people to put on the glasses. You know what I'm saying? You won't guide a lot of people to put on these glasses. Like, let's say for example, you got a product, and this product is glasses and you're and you're selling glasses in your store these glasses like help you see better i'm saying these glasses help you really see past the illusions of the matrix and you're selling a lot of these glasses and these glasses are gonna free a lot of bloodlines free a lot of bloodlines you're gonna awaken you want to help awaken other people bloodlines you want to free people from addictions you want to free people from hell you know what i'm saying you're going to free people from hell you want to uh help people raise their vibration hell is a mindset hell doesn't exist 
if you if you if you feel like hell is real, it's because you've been to hell before, because you was at that hell mindset before. You was you was living the hell experience, but now you are experiencing a heaven on earth. I'm saying you are here to experience a heaven on earth in this lifetime. I'm saying when other people see you living your truth, you are going to awaken the masses to their truth. You feel me? You are a threat. You are a big threat right now. Like you, you've been a threat your whole life, but. You're scaring a lot of people because they haven't seen nothing like you. Like, these clones are literally scared of you. They are avoiding you. They are trying to copy you. They are trying to be you. they like, how can I be like her? How can I be like him? How? What's the sauce? What's the recipe? You feel me? These clones cannot think for themselves. You think for yourself. These clones cannot do things by themselves. You're you're on this journey by yourself. You are here to do it by yourself. You know I'm saying everything is divine. You will meet the right people at the right time. And these right people was these people you're gonna meet. They was all a part of the script. You feel me? So don't be surprised when you meet people, and these people are not. Genuine. You know what I'm saying? These people are not genuine. These people do not have the best intentions for you. Like, they don't want the best for you. They want you to be stuck like them. When people see you leveling up, it's like, damn, like, how can we stop this person from leveling up? And these people are actually clones for the Matrix. You know what I'm saying they are program clones for the matrix. They that they have no connection to reality. They lost connection to a reality. You know what I'm saying when the motherfucker is not in tune with reality, when the motherfucker is not in tune with their self, when the motherfucker lost, like when a motherfucker really disconnect from reality, they become a clone. Their clone took over. Their clone took over their life. Now they're now they are not conscious that they are a clone. Now they are not aware that they are a clone because literally their conscience was replaced. You know I'm saying they went back to a low vibration, and this low vibration was demons waiting for them, and these demons that was waiting for them. Jumped in their body, attacked their vessel, and changed the way they and changed the way they view reality. And the way they view reality now is what you see in the material. They don't view things through a spiritual lens no more. They view things from a, a material lens. You know I'm saying, and this material lens is actually black magic that's being used to control their mind. You're going to meet a lot of people that have no control over their mind. So everything they say, everything they do is literally projection. You know what I'm saying? They're going to project on you a lot. You feel me? I'm here. I'm here right now. You're going to you're going to meet a lot of people that's going to project on to you. You're going to meet a lot of clones that are going to project on to you. But it's all for a reason. It's all for a purpose. You are here to strengthen your spiritual gift. Don't forget that. You are here to strengthen your spiritual gift and everything is divine. You're going to meet the people that's for you at the right divine, quote unquote, timing. Time doesn't exist. But you're going to meet the right people in this lifetime. And these right people are a part of your are a part of your story. They are a part of your movie. They are a part of your book. You feel me? So look, y'all. Whoever I'm talking to right now. You have went through a portal and you have shifted realities and everything is finna go your way. When I say everything is finna go your way, I mean everything is finna go the way the divine wanted to go. You know what I'm saying? You are divine. So 
when things are going not how you expect it to go, that means everything is going your way. Promise you. When things are going how you didn't expect, how you didn't imagine, best believe things are going your way. It's going your way. It's working in your favor. Like whatever you're doing, keep on doing it. Whatever you're doing, keep on doing it. You know what I'm saying? Keep on doing it. You got this. I'm always by your side. I'm always rooting for you. And it's a blessing how I'm able to really deliver this message to you. And congratulations. And I just, you know what I'm saying? I see you. you know what I'm saying? I see you. Whoever you are, I see you. Respect. You know what I'm saying nothing but respect because you got a lot of respect in the spiritual realm. Whoever gave me this message to deliver from the spiritual realm. I appreciate you, and I, I I respect the person, I respect the soul, I respect the spirit that I'm talking to right now because you got a lot of say so, you got a lot of respect, a lot of people is vouching for you in the spiritual realm, and I like to say I'm proud of you, and I'm just genuine when it comes to this message. It's all genuine, and I like to thank your spirit team, I like to thank your ancestors, I like to thank Almighty God, of course, because. We are the Almighty God children, but I'd like to appreciate and shout out your spirit team and your angelic beings, your angels, your um, your ancestors that are protecting you. You feel me? I love y'all.